So here we are in the kitchen and I have my garbage disposal cleaner tabs up here. Um, I do love on the back of the packaging here, I get step-by-step -step directions on exactly how to do it. So we're gonna go through it together. Um, so step one, we're gonna make sure that the disposal is empty and I'm gonna go ahead, it says run the hottest water from the tap for one minute. My household water here, we have our hot water tank turned up, it gets very hot. So I know that this is gonna do its job really, really well. Um, and just by this is kind of heating up a little bit and running for about a minute, I'm just going to talk um, and explain that I had some flowers this week left over from Valentine's Day. And in my flower water in the vase, there was quite a bit of dead leaves and some stems that had a pretty disgusting odor. And when I dumped it down the drain, there's a little bit of residual in there and there's been an odor coming from the drain. And we use our garbage disposal a lot. So it does get a lot of wear and tear. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and let this sun on. I don't know if you guys can see the smoke coming off of my water here, but it is really hot. And I think it's probably been about a minute. Um, and I'm just going to turn the garbage disposal on just to make sure that there's nothing in there. Okay, and it sounds like it's nice and empty. So we're going to go on to step two here. So we're going to reduce the water down to a small stream, less than about the thickness of a pencil. And I'm going to turn the tap away from the drain so that it's not running directly down the drain. It's just getting a little bit of water runoff. And then with the water running, we're going to put one big tablet into the disposal. And then since this is the first time cleaning um, and there's heavy residue, we can add a second big tablet. So I'm going to use two just because this is our first time cleaning. I'm going to open it up and I'm going to drop it in. I'm going to grab a second tablet and drop it in. This is something nice to have on hand. And I don't know if you guys can see, but it looks like it's starting to bubble a little bit, it's starting to dissolve a little. And I'm just going to go back to my directions here. Switch on and run the disposal. And I'll pop that in. Run the disposal for one minute. It smells really nice. It has a really nice fresh scent coming from it. I can hear it breaking up a little bit inside of my garbage disposal and Got my hot water going. It's already smelling better. I'm excited to see how this works. So just for the sake of the video, just so that I'm giving you guys a good accurate review, I'm gonna let this run for the full minute. So I'm just gonna kind of stand here. But I can tell you so far it smells really good and I can see that it's you know, kicking up some residue in there. There's been a lot of times, and I'm sure anybody with a garbage disposal can relate, that we come down in the morning and you know you can smell some leftover dinner or some food residue in there from the night before. So it's great to have these on hand. So I think it's been about a minute. I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to turn my hot water off and turn my garbage disposal off. And I don't want to stick my hand down in there because that's not really safe, but I'm going to kind of just use a knife to push these little tabs out of the way. And I can tell you guys, the inside of this looks so good. It looks really, really clean. It looks so, there's no residue. It looks like some, it knocked off some of the rust in there. This is good. I'm giving this product a really awesome review. I'm excited to continue to use it. We have a full year supply here. I don't anticipate I'm going to have to do this again anytime in the next couple weeks. If I need it, I got it, but I have a full year supply. So I'm going to make this part of my routine cleaning. Um, I'm going to use it once a month. And definitely when these run out, I'm going to be ordering more. So yeah, I like it.